<laughs> Pretty much what, I'm, what I try to do is, is, is create an inspiration with people through, through, through passion, through, through, the, through the heart, through the words of inspiration. You know, and, and of course, um, uh, uh, fundraising and getting everybody together. You know, but to show that that whoever you are in life, regardless where you're coming from, if you write a story to empower you, you will create a destiny that will fulfill you. So, what would you like to do after your fight career? I mean, because these are these are words of politicians, people who have a, a, a voice in the, in the community, and Manny's done it past you know his fighting career. I mean, you see yourself doing something like that? Um, not quite. You know, again, it, it's it's a it's a thing for me. You know. I I feel that if I become a politician, there's just so many things that, that that gets taken from me, from the way I think, from the way I want to do things, you know. So for me, in order for, for, for me to, to contribute, the first thing is creating a mindset of empowerment within everybody. And that's what I want to do is either talk to people about it, you know, and, 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 and create something. Because it's really not the politics that leads, it's if you can lead the people to create a mindset that, that changes the world. Not, not somebody who will lead them to change them of who they are. Gotcha. But if you create a mindset for them to change who they are, to empower who they are, you'll change the world. Well, you sound like a great citizen. Now, in, with that being said, would you vote for Manny if he ran for president of the Philippines? Honestly, I probably wouldn't. I probably wouldn't. Depends on how he is going to be. You know, because, I mean, in order for you to become a president, you have to take the words of the people, you have to be there, you have to take the time. But if he can do it, the thing is, he's, he's proven himself as a congressman, as a senator, you know, but he's, he's not presented himself well as a politician. He's presented himself as a, a celebrity. But in terms of, of becoming a president, you have to put your effort, your mind, your, yourself. The thing is, the guy has passion. And if you can create that and, and be there for it, then yeah, he might be a great president. But that's something that, you know, it's like, it's like going inside the ring. You know, whose Manny's going to come in this today? Is it a Manny that's just going to go with the flow or a Manny who's going to go and, and take everything from everybody else? What would it take to get your vote then? What, what has he done wrong thus far? As well, he, for once, he is the most absentee in, 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 in the Congress, you know, and um, sometimes you got to be true to your word. I mean, I love Manny. He's a great friend of mine, but I'm looking at it as a man who... Uh, who wants the country to be better you know in order for him to to be to get my vote is he has to commit if he says I'm retired I give you my word on it <laughs> then you stay that way right like Hagler Hagler was a guy he said I'm done he was done right and for me if people ask me when I'm gonna retire I'm gonna keep pushing until I get there but when I do I, when I do go I go <laughs> you know what I'm saying so um, it's just to create a word that people can trust you know, and, and, and to be there for the people, to take the time, the passion, to make it happen. You know, then I can say, oh, you know what, because I know you're a great guy. I know, I know you want to put in it, you got the passion already, but if you're going to take the time to do it and learn it and, and, and do it for the people, okay, you got my vote. Last question, with that being said, would you vote for him over one of our two candidates that are running for office here in the United States? Because you, you watched the debates last night? Yep. See, that's the thing is I missed the debate because I was sparring. You're getting little scars on my face right now. So I missed it, um, but but my wife and I were kind of gonna, gonna try to talk about it and see see how it goes, you yeah, know. Yeah. But um, you know, there's a lot of things going around in terms of, of who they are and what they've done. But in the past, it's always been that way. It's just that it's just that now social media is all over the place. Right. So every dirty laundry comes out. You know what I'm saying? But again, it's a matter of who leads the person well. But for me, it's more the fact that who each and every one of you you felt that is your take you know it's not about what i can endorse or what i can say because celebra celebrities has great power in endorsing others to to make them vote for somebody even though they don't want to you know so for me my suggestion would be who in your heart think that you guys deserve to be at the at, at the level you know and that's yeah. pretty much what i can always say